Welcome back to day 13 of the coronavirus break vlog. Today is March 28th, and uh, I'd like to give a special shout out to my friend Noah. Happy birthday. Hope everything's going good. And today, I'm supposed to do a lot, a good bit of homework for that essay coming up, but I've not done anything. I pretty much laid around and watched movies all day. One of those <laughs> lazy days, I, I guess some people call it. And uh, one of the COVID-19 or coronavirus news, there are now over 100 people, 100 in the state of West Virginia that have been tested positive. The number is around 115, um, but it's crazy because a week ago, there was like nobody here in West Virginia with it. Now it has exploded. So if you have symptoms, please stay home and self-quarantine and try not to spread it. And if you don't have symptoms, make sure you practice social distancing and don't go to any large gatherings and practice good hygiene. And on the TSA fact of the day, the TSA fact of the day is more of a question really from a viewer. Uh, she asked what kind of contest I've been involved in and other kids from my chapter have been, been involved in and uh, what exactly Pumpkin Drop is. Well, we, we've been involved in uh, projects anywhere from building a small dragster car with a CO2 cartridge all the way up to designing fashion, like fashion design and designing dresses and whatnot. And uh, currently, me and a lot of my uh, fellow TSAers from Tyler Consolidated have been on a uh, chapter team, which is a parliamentary procedure, kind of like Parley Pro and FFA, where we have to run a business meeting and a parliamentary procedure and take a test, and whoever gets higher on the test and does better in the meeting wins the competition. So that was pretty fun. I learned a lot in that. And pumpkin drop is where you get a uh, pumpkin and put it in a box that you have made and dropping off, drop it off a, like, 11-story building? Yeah, 11-story building. And whoever pumpkin does not break and is in the middle of the target wins. And... Uh, Thanks for listening, and I'll see you tomorrow on day 14.